about casting and I've got Big J Lee with us, the main man. Hello. How are you doing mate? Alright mate. Alright. Yeah. Good. Good. If he doesn't know something about casting, it's not worth knowing. So today I'm just going to do my original fishing cast and then Jay's going to give us a couple of pointers and see if I can gain a bit more distance on my cast. Give a few shots of Jay doing a few casts as well. And also John's here with us as well, we'll get a few with John. Um, Lively, the fishing is terrible around here at the moment. So just to get out and do a bit, bed up the day, I'm just going to do a bit of casting. Um, just while the fishing is quiet. So yeah, I'll, uh, I'll bring you back, get some casting away. Hopefully you enjoy the video. Thank you. Let's do it. Let's do it, mate. Right, so as you've just seen, I've just done my, that's just my fishing cast. Well, you'll see 90% of me fishing, if there was enough for us to do that swing, what I do. Um, Jay's just had a little chat with us there, he's just going to explain what he thinks would help me get that bit few more distance. So what have you seen, Jay, there? Right. Yes, it's a powerful lad. Uh, he is a powerful lad, but we're getting away from it. He's up here with all the body. There's no... I feel there's no hip or body weight transfer going through the past because it's already flattened in the upper body where what I was saying from if we can get them so he's transferred the weight Tip. 
which I think is fantastic. Really, really nice rod to use fishing and cast. Um, so yeah, we'll give that a go now. See how we get on. You know what, why you didn't let it go there? Right, I'm just going to uh, do a quick video of John doing his, he's using my rod and reel there now and he's just going to do his um, fishing cast um, as he would fishing. And I know a lot of lads, a lot of North East lads use this style, like the Hatteras cast, um, at plenty of distance. So I'll get a video of him doing that and I'll get a video of him doing his, his feed cast um, just to show the difference. As you know, some sometimes you just haven't got that space to, to have a long long drop, like I do. Um, so sometimes you've got to have a shorter drop and just get it away quick. And it would all works, all works. So um, we'll get a quick video, John, doing his cast, and then uh, we'll move on from there. All right. As you can see, that was totally effortless there. Just a swing back, and away she goes. Absolutely effortless cast, and just still gain the distance. As you can see, Jay's using a high range there as well. Better with a fixed as, he, as he's saying there, it's, it's a better cast with a fixed bow. Um, they're totally effortless. Say so sometimes you don't need the big, big long drop and a big swing and tournament style. As long as that timing's right, seeing how quick it is, I'm just going to go right down to it. Right, we're going to get Jay to do his full, uh, full tournament swing now. Um, same again, he's using the XT435 with a glass tip in. Uh, field casting reel, so we'll see, uh, we'll see how it goes.
still travelling now. I felt the water came into my feet. Guys, Jay's now got my rod, XT435 and the glass tip, Shimano Bullseye, Lord Woodbraid. And he's going to show you how effortful this is when you actually get the timing right, which at the moment I haven't got the timing at all. Um, literally, my distance from the original cast is all coming from power. There's no timing there whatsoever, there's no smoothness to it. See Jay doing that. Lead. I've got a wet Out foot. I've got a wet foot. <laughs> right, first of all, Jay, thank you very much, mate. You're welcome, mate. Thank, thank, you. Thank, you. thank you very much. Yeah, I've got a funny day. Like I say, I'm, I'm miles up from these guys. Do. Um, fishing cast wise, I'm quite happy with my cast until you see these guys cast in totally different types of fish. Um, the distance these guys create. Very little effort as well, by the way. It's phenomenal. So I take my hat off to the lads, like. So, okay, um, just a little bit about the rod. I'm going to have lads probably asking us. Uh, so just, can you give us a little uh, rundown of the yes. uh, rod, please? This one here is the XT435. Originally, it's got a carbon tip, full carbon. Yeah. Uh, however, a lot of lads were saying, bouncing the leads out sometimes on a big sea. Yeah. Great on the cliffs, great on the rough ground. Yeah. Well, however, if you fish beaches and that, fast tides, with a firm tip on it, it will bounce in the lead out. Yeah. So, uh, I wanted a glass tip, but not a full glass tip. Yeah. Because uh, on the casting field, I used to be using, I used to use yeah. which in my eyes was one of the best rods in the world. Yeah. Uh, it's been good for me. And uh, it was just the one thing I didn't used to like about was that over recovery, like the turn of the tip. Yeah. So that's why I wanted the glass tip to try and stop that over. I wanted a tip that would sit over in the tide. Yeah. But when you cast out, you not have that too much wobble, tip yes. wobble. Yeah. So that's why I got a, a bit carbon put in with the glass. It seems to stop that, the tip wobble that we get, where it did. on a fast tide, it will tip over nice. Yeah, so... And it's proven to be a nice rod. Yeah. Like a nice... Oh, it's a fantastic fish. Yeah. So that's basically what you've done there, Jay. The product you've created is yeah. the best of both worlds, really, isn't it? It it's is, it certainly is. This is perfect. the same rod that I use on the back of the So... It's the exact same combination. Yeah, so perfect for you guys on the field, yeah. as well as perfect for the likes of me who's out fishing all the time. Yeah. Any conditions and you can go and use it in the heavy stuff. That's but it. then again it's at home down the beaches on the strong tide pull. Absolutely, absolutely, and that's what it's all about. And I mean it, it's still got a nice right Yeah. So well, and that's that's what people want. They yeah. want a, a good powerful rod. 
the end of the paper, we want that. We want to see the banks. The first time I used it, uh, I got. A, I seen the Rockland bite, and yeah. I used it. Was a decent sized Rockland, as good as Rockland get, by the way. Um, and I mean. I couldn't believe how, how nice the tip was in it. Yeah. Um, for such a powerful rock, yeah. you've still got that tip over there, and I felt every little lunge off a of Rockland. Oh, definitely. But then I was next to it, I got a decent cod yeah. over like the mixed ground, and I was so in control because yeah. you've just got that power, haven't you? That's it. As well as the lovely, uh, lovely little bit of yeah. the tip, which is fantastic in my opinion. It'll give you as much power as you'll ever need, and it'll give you as much sensitivity. Like, like you say, it's sure that the small fish as well, yeah. not just the big fish. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah. yeah really I'm happy with the way it's turned out. Yeah, really good. Really good. yeah like I say, Jay, top man, really good bloke. He'll help anyone. That's say, right. Any questions you've got about any products he's got, give him a shout. Yeah. He'll always be there to help. Same with Maxine. Great people, great products every time. Thank we're on Facebook, day. we're on Monday, uh, Messenger. Drop a um, message on Messenger and uh, contact the uh, Yeah, get in touch. Like you say, any questions you've got, give us a shout on YouTube and I'll point us in the right direction. I can send you to the shop. Like you say, he's got the range in there, you can go and have yeah. a look. He'll, like you say, anything you need to know, he's the man. If anyone right. wants to come and have a go, they can come and take one and exactly. have a go. Exactly, can't get no fair than that. No, that's fantastic. Yeah. Right, so I'll thank you for watching again. I'll thank you again. Top no man. Thank you very much. Anytime. Mate. Thank you. Anytime at all. See you again on the next one. Thank yeah, you yeah. very much. Take care.